Let me, this is a U-Paw wig with a closure included into it. Everything is basically, it's called a full, a full wig that I did. Um, yes, yeah, U-Paw wig with the closure. Um, everything is, um, together. I don't have a picture of me, the a wig. A matter of fact, I do have a picture of how the wig looked after I was finished sewing it down. And I'm just going to leave that picture right here. As you can see, the picture's going to be right here. And I'm just going to show you guys how that wig looked when I first did it, before I cut it, and all that good stuff. I do have a picture. So, um, it's um, three bundles of 12 inches, and it's a 10 inch closure. I colored everything myself. The way I do my u paw wigs, I have to have my u paw wigs. Um, sold down. I can't have um, my u power wigs with clips. I can't have it. Um, what else? The other method. Bobby pins. All that nonsense. Yeah, I can't do that. I have to use a needle and I have to use some thread um, for my u power wigs. There's no way I can have my u power wigs um, taken off at night. Yeah, I don't have time for that. And best to believe I'll be going outside looking crazy every day because yeah, I really don't have time for that. Um, I just like for my hair to be very secure and all I do is just get a dome cap. I just trace my head, my head, my head where I'm gonna, where I'm gonna, um, sew down my braids to, uh, and tack my ears just because, um, I don't want nothing on my ears. So I just make sure I tack on my ears. As you can see, everything's so down. So I'm gonna show you guys the back, um, right now. Um, just before I show you guys, I just wanted to let you know the um, this bob is really simple. It's not um, it's not the little feathery um, bob in the back. I really didn't want that look. This is basically um, this is basically how um, um, Nicki Minaj usually have her um, bob, but she have a bang. It used to be real long in the um, it'd be a blunt cut going across in the back, and it'd be um. I'm longer in the front. I really wanted a longer bob. I didn't want the short bob look just just because I wanted something different. Um, I really and I also didn't know if I was gonna do a middle part or a side part. So I really had to um, debate on that. I think if I would have did a side part, I think I would have did the feathery look because the front would have been feathered and I would have liked the back to be feathered too. But just because I did a middle part, I didn't want it. I really wanted this bob to be really sleek. And I didn't want too much going on just because I did color it. And I feel like the color speaks for itself. So I want me cutting um, the bob just because it's really hard to... Um, to cut in the back and record at the same time, but there's uh, a lot of people that been asking me to um, do a bob for them because you know, of course, this is bob season, so everybody wants the short look. So I make sure I record a, um, a video on me installing somebody bob and they hair, just because it will be easy for me to film and um, and to do it. Um, all I did was just put the I just section um, the hair behind my um, ears. A little behind my edges because I want it to be longer, and um, I just put it here in a ponytail, and I just um, cut it up, and it gives you this angle look. And this is the same ponytail that um, I this from this his hair. This is the exact ponytail, and I I kept it just purposely for this video. And all I did was I just took the scissors. So this is how the ponytail was in the back of my head, and I just took the scissor and I just cut it up. As you can see, I'll go to the side, it's, in, it's angled. As you can see, the bob is, is, is angled, as you can see. I know I ramble a lot in this video, but I've just been going from the camera for so long, I feel like I'm missing something out. But I hope I didn't ramble too much, I hope you didn't get bored. And that's all I have guys for today, and I'll talk to you guys later. Yeah.